Hey guys, this is Quinn, that snazzy iPhone guy, and this is the review of the Javo Edge Fiber Access Case from JavoEdge.com. It retails for $39.95 and is an excellent all-around case. I'm going to get into the features and have a hands-on here in a minute, but first, a memorial and a dedication to my iPad. I am trading it tomorrow for a 2008 uh, unibody MacBook. Unfortunately, I do have to depart from my iPad for expense reasons. Um, I do need a MacBook for school, and uh, the only way I could do it, you know, the only way I could get a MacBook with good specs is to sell my iPad, and that's what I'm doing tomorrow. But this is the last and final review you will see with this beautiful iPad, and it's a good case. So, uh, on that note, uh, this is the Jabo Edge Fiber Access case. As you can see, the physical surface is, um, it feels carbon fibery, but it's not actually hard. Um, it is, I mean, it is firm, and it is a, but it is a softer texture on the front. It's like a leathery feel, and uh, it has a really nice soft leather feel to it. Now, this will add some bulk, not a ton, but a little bit, because it is um, not only a case, but also a stand. Um, if you look at the case part of it, there is this hard shell, which we can pop off the iPad right here if you want to see it. So that is a hard case and all you need to do is take your iPad and uh, snap her in there and you're good to go. Now this is a hard shelled case and then this is the stand slash cover. Um, it rotates which is really nice so when you go to prop it up you can uh, prop it in multiple directions. Um, it has loosened up significantly when I first got it and I put it like that I thought I had actually broken it because it had been really firm but now it's loosey goosey and goes everywhere but um, this back part is a hard shell and then this is a soft shell probably a cardboard center I'm guessing but uh, it feels nice and does its job well. Now you can probably Prop up the iPad in three different heights, a quite vertical one, um, not 90 degrees, but pretty significantly high. Um, see all my garbage back there? When you get a lot of stuff to review, you don't have a lot of time to clean up. And uh, you get all that right there, and then one down, and then another down. And uh, this is the angle at which you could type, and then you can even kind of just lay it flat down so it's more than higher up, but it's a little bit more planed. So all in all, it's a really good case. The stitching, everything on it is very well done. There's the Java Wedge logo right there with some kind of, I don't know what that is. Inside it's going to feel like a microfiber, kind of with this soft texture, and then there are the rubber feet in which the iPad stands, which gently place themselves against the screen when the iPad closes. As you can see there, it doesn't put a lot of pressure on one point, and you will notice that when it is compressed with a bunch of books and a backpack or something like that, you will notice the rubber streaks, especially when it's dirty inside, but it hasn't caused any harm to my iPad. It has a very beautiful magnetic closure. You just pop it open when you're ready, and you pop it closed when you're done, it's not going to give you problems, it's going to stay there. So uh, all in all, I think this is a really excellent case. I apologize to Java Edge for the belated review, and I apologize to you for having to sell my iPad. But uh, it has been a good time, it has been an adventure, I really like this case, I really love this device. And as always, stay snazzy. See you later, folks.